Hey guys, welcome to this episode of Reseller TV. Your host is always Josh. Welcome. Um, I'm a re full-time reseller and uh, to show stuff that I that I've sold so, or or find so that you guys can uh, know how good the if it's a uh, good good thing to buy when you're out thrifting or whatever to resell yourself. Um, so like, follow, subscribe, whatever, and you just keep up with what I'm uh, when I'm selling and everything. I did my uh, end of the year uh, um, some numbers and stuff, and it looks like action figures were probably about so about ten thousand dollars in just action figures last year and then i did like twenty nine thousand dollars in storage units and i started buying in may so i'm gonna definitely keep up on that there's gonna be another storage unit that i buy coming up this weekend um so look out for that i'm gonna do a video on that um lots of cool stuff to show you i had 36 sales this weekend for 36 sales for uh, $780, uh, right around there. eBay, Etsy, Poshmark were my three. A couple bolos, a couple other you know things to maybe not look out for, I think. Uh, <laughs> I'll go over everything. Um, my co-host today is Austin Powers. Yeah, baby. <laughs> uh, he sold for $10 on Etsy. Nothing crazy. He's just on a big... I buy lots of toys, so he'll go bundles of toys. So he'll go, he's you know all profit. Anyways, let's get into that sold. Um, jeans are one of my worst selling things. These seven jeans I got from the bins all, years ago. Finally sold for $12, I think. These were pretty, this is it, uh, Victoria's Secret pants were given to me for free. They sat for like one or two months. I had a lot of watches on them. Um, I actually have the, I put the um, <laughs> matching sweatshirt. I probably would have should have sold them together, but uh, that's still for sale. But yeah, these sold for like thirteen dollars. Another pair of jeans I got from a storage unit. They're plus size. They sold for thirteen. Um, not a terribly long uh, for jeans for me at least. Not terribly long from a storage unit as well. This Andre by Unit sold for fourteen dollars. And then game plan here sold for eight dollars on Etsy. It's a Peyton Manning, just a little um, newspaper type of deal. Phlebotany handbook sold for fourteen on Etsy. Um, we got two. Oh, here, I'll take this out of the way. Uh, this was eight dollars. It's a beat up little uh, VHS. Still sold for eight dollars, all profit after fees and whatnot. Uh, Fire and C. This sold for fifteen dollars. Uh, the Sports Illustrates were $9 each. They were free to me. So I'm going to pay $10 for the... Not all of these are going, but uh, these broken watch parts. 10 bucks for those out of a storage unit. Another storage unit. This was $9 on Etsy. $10. Another storage unit. It's a uh, Cans uh, pocket token. And then we have... I already showed Austin Powers. $10 on him. 15 for this Return of the Jedi. I bought him in a bulk buy of toys. Another storage unit, little $10 necklace, uh, $10 for this vintage Hot Wheel. I buy, uh, oh yeah, the other thing, I sold like $3,000 worth of just regular old Hot Wheels. I think I had one red line that I sold last year and that was it. <laughs> the rest were all uh, just regular old Hot Wheels that people were buying. Uh, this flat out PC game sold for $14 on Etsy. These guys, these, this lot of little pirate figures sold for $15 on eBay. 15 on eBay for this Halloween Haunt uh, Nosberry Farm button uh, out of a storage unit. These are my most recent storage unit. These two computer figures sold for $10 each, one train and one dog. Let me pet that dog. And then we have, I'll go over the uh, uh, 16 for this Pan Animal Slim. It's that for, um, yeah, it's been sitting for quite a while. Glad to see that go. One of my longest tenured items, my Maryland Terrapins. Glad to see that go. Sold for like 15 bucks or something 20 bucks for this not a great uh a great flip on that that one sat for a while and i actually paid like 10 bucks for it so not great on that one this is another thing that i thought would sell for a little bit more i think it sold for 23 on ebay and then the best uh best sale today is actually this for 117 it's a national finals rodeo uh wool uh vest and I got that from Goodwill up in northern Idaho. And then we have this was given. Uh, I got this for free when I bought 100 soda bottles. Vintage soda bottles. And it sold for $22. I actually got two of those for free. 25 This was also from northern Idaho. Uh, from their Goodwill. $25. Bucks, another thing from northern Idaho. These were um, uh, $16 for these uh, pencils. I bought in a bulk lot of Seattle um, Seahawks stuff. 
Stephen King and the Terrace, fifteen dollars each on those two. Etsy and eBay for that. Uh, Twenty dollars on Etsy for this uh, '90s GI Joe's uh, thing. Probably could have got a little bit more if I were ready, but you know, someone offers you something if you pay for a dollar for. Then I sold this bowling ball from a storage unit, sold for thirty-five. OGO uh, golf bag sold for seventy dollars on eBay. The bowling ball sold on eBay. Both pretty quick sales. And then the second best sale of the day after that vest from earlier, Steve Prefontaine, one hundred and fifteen dollars on eBay. Thanks, guys.